learners, I'm Rachel Santillas, your teacher for today. For today's video, I will discuss the suggested learning games in grade 4. The suggested learning games that I will be discussing for today is all about Tumbang Preso. What comes into your mind when you see a sleeper and can in a games? Yes, very good! It's Tumbang Preso. Tumbang Preso is a popular Filipino straight game also known as Presohat. The game requires three or more players. Each player is provided with a large throwaway object, could be slippers or a shoe, called tamato. A semi-flattened empty tin or plastic container, the size of an 8 or 12 ohms tin, is placed in upright position 6 or 8 meters from the throwing line. Safety measure. Check your surroundings. Make sure that there is an appropriate place and spacious enough for your activities. Checking for things that may bump or hurt you must be done before the activities. Procedure for this activity. First, a player is drawn as the prisoner, usually through a system like jack and toy. The prisoner will guard the empty thing or container. Second, the other players stand at the throwing line. They take turns throwing their pamato at the empty team, throwing, trying to knock it down. Third, as soon as the can is knocked down, the prisoner must put back the team upright position before he can tag the any of the players attempting to recover their pamato. Fourth, if the pamato becomes too close to the team in an upright position, the prisoner can step on both with one foot. The owner of the pamato becomes the new prisoner. Fifth, the prisoner can also tag the players while recovering their pamato outside the throwing line. Sixth, after each throw, a player must recover his pamato. Should he be tagged by the prisoner, before he reaches the throwing line. He becomes the prisoner in the next game. Playing Tumbang Preso provides the most opportunities for exercise without stress. Muscles are flexed as children try to balance and coordinate their body movements to achieve the object of the game. Did you understand class? Okay, that's all for today. I hope you've learned something from our lesson. Thank you for listening and God bless.